Twister OS is one of the best, amazing and beautiful operating system made for Raspberry Pi 4. Using this single Linux operating system, you can have the feel of Linux, Windows and Mac OS operating system using your Raspberry Pi 4 board. What's going on guys, this is me Mehdi Shakil and you are watching SS Tech Tutorial. So guys, in this video, I am going to show you how you can get this Twister OS on your Raspberry Pi so that you can get the feel of Linux, Windows XP, Windows 7, Windows 10 and as well as Mac OS Big Sur and Mojave feels on your Raspberry Pi at a single place. In this video, I am going to show you how you can install this Twister OS on your Raspberry Pi for board. So without talking too much, let's get started. Ok guys, to get the Twister OS, just simply go to Google and search for Twister OS or navigate to twisteros.com and you will have the Twister OS official website. Here using this slider, you can get an idea what type of themes you will get in this Linux operating system. You will get the Linux, Windows 95, XP, Windows 7, 10 and Mac OS feel in this single operating system. Also if you are a Windows or Mac user and just want to switch in Linux, then this OS will be the great choice for you to get started in Linux. Not only theme guys, this OS is completely game ready and also has pre-installed all the requirement software and application you might need into an OS. I said game ready because it's pre-installed RetroPie Steam on this operating system. Also these are all the application and multimedia feature you will get into this operating system. To get this OS file, just go to download and from here you can download the Twister OS for Raspberry Pi and the desktop. You can download it from here. Also you need a Raspberry Pi imager to flash this OS on SD card. You will find that imager in this website or you can just go to Raspberry Pi official website and download it from there. I had already downloaded and installed Raspberry Pi imager on my computer. Now let's see how to flash. First of all, connect your SD card with your computer using the SD card reader. Then just simply open up your Raspberry Pi imager. Now click on choose OS, scroll down and click on use custom. Then select the Twister OS image file. After that click on choose storage and select your SD card. Then click on write and it will start flashing the OS on SD card. It will take some time. So just wait. Ok, after the flashing, remove the SD card from your PC and insert it into your Raspberry Pi 4. Also connect the peripherals like keyboard, mouse, monitor with your Raspberry Pi and give the power to your Raspberry Pi. And here like this, you will get the Twister OS running on your Raspberry Pi 4. This is the default welcome screen for Twister OS. From here, you can configure your Raspberry Pi display, interfaces, localization and also using this, you can update the Twister OS. And from here, you can choose the themes. I'll do it later. Now our Twister OS is ready to use. The UI is very beautiful of this Linux operating system. I said this OS game ready because you can see here, it pre-installed Scrappy to mirror your Android skin. Also, it installed RetroPie and Steam in this Linux operating system. Ok, now let me show you how to change the UI and get other OS feel like Windows and Mac OS. Here you will get a shortcut for theme switcher. Just click on it and it will give you option to select your desired UI theme. From here, you can use this Twister OS as Windows 95, Windows XP, 7, 10 and Mac OS. All of those UI are available in the light and dark theme. Let's try this Windows 10 light theme. You need to restart your Raspberry Pi every time you change the UI. Here you can see now it's completely look like Windows 10 operating system. All the start menu icons are similar to Windows 10. Now let's test Windows XP. And like the same way you can have the macOS feel on this Twister OS. 
Isn't it amazing feature of this Twister OS? And that's why I said this is the best operating system for Raspberry Pi I have ever used. So guys, that's all for today. I hope you like this video. If you really like this video and enjoy this video, then please give it a big thumbs up and share this video with your friends. And guys, if you're new to this channel, then please do subscribe to this YouTube channel and don't forget to press the bell icon to get all the latest upcoming video tutorial notification. I'm Mehdi Shakil, you are watching a Tech Tutorial and I'm signing out.